Alright guys, so this is a river plugin, and the monitor's messed up. Uh, for Unreal Engine 4, it allows you to control every aspect kind of thing and uh, bring it down to level. I don't know how to use it for the life of me. I've been trying, but it's been ridiculously overcomplicated for me, that is. But this is the type of river that you can expect when using it. Um, if you don't know exactly how things would look with the river as it is, uh, we're going to do this. Okay. River's a bit big, it's moving a bit fast. But it runs well at least. It's not really done as of yet, I don't think. And um, where's the river thing at? Yeah, we're gonna have to go into world outliner here. River tool. See? Change the depth. You can apply the uh, terrain changes. Even though sometimes it messes things up. <coughs> and I'm getting sick again. There we go. See? So if we drag that along a little more, I think maybe we could get things to work a bit better. Back to modes. Um, You update the splines, it automatically changes it to something weird, land high or something. I don't, I don't friggin' know. You got all of these weird little things that you can do. You can even change the water height. Now, until he releases a video on how to use this farther, I'm just here informing you about the river tool, so. It's an interesting concept. Here's the splines.
it just runs a little too fast for my liking, but hey, that's just me. Anyway, that's it, guys. Here's the tool. I don't have the link for it. I will go try to find it, and we'll update the video when I do have it. It's available on Gumroad, and there's only like 27 things on there for Unreal Engine, so it should be pretty easy to find. Bye.